and welcome to Gemini Anonymous. As you can see on the screen, we are playing something different. I happen to see this what April 1st by chance on YouTube and I was like, "Wait, what's what's going on with Sonic?" <laughs> so, they came up with a new game. Apparently, this is years in the making and they had uh I guess fans letting them know what type of games they wanted to see from Sonic. So this is called The Murder of Sonic the Hedgehog. For those that do not know, Sonic was one of the first console games I've ever played. Uh, Sega was my first console game I ever had. Uh, not technically mine, I had a share. <laughs> it was Sonic and Street Fighter, I think I remember them being the first two games. And I think Street of Rage 2. Um, I am a huge fan of Sonic. Uh, people that was watching like, a couple of months back, I was playing Sonic Mania and you know how much grief that game has caused me. Made me feel like I didn't know what I was doing. Like I've never played a Sonic anything. I didn't appreciate that. <laughs> so... I'm glad I have my, uh, I'll have, to, I'll have to cut this AC off, like it's just, um, so we're gonna sit here and go through this, I am curious, because this is interesting, I am also into, like, mystery detective style type books, I was since I was little, uh, even shows that I watch. I have a couple of mystery books at home. I used to like just go to the library, not even go to lunch and just look for books that were <laughs> based on like detective mystery, bit of thriller, long as not horror. <laughs> um, so I am curious. I'm curious to see how this goes. Um, I've seen a lot of episodes of uh, Detective Conan, so hopefully that plays out <laughs> with helping. Hopefully, this, I'm not sure how loud this is. I'm gonna be honest. Um, for me, it seemed a bit loud when I was when I turned it on a couple of minutes ago. I was like, "Oh, this seems kind of loud." So I'm not sure how it's gonna be for everybody. I even lowered the volume on here. I think I'm going to lower it just a little bit more. I think I'll do that and then I'll up the game volume. Hopefully that's good? I'm not sure. I'm gonna be real honest with you. Like, to me, it sounds loud, and this is not even halfway. Um, you know what? I can check on my phone. I don't understand why I didn't think of that. I apologize. So, we're just gonna check on my phone and see just how loud this game is. Give me one moment. It doesn't seem to overpower my voice because I'm listening to it while... So if y'all hear that in the background, that's my phone. I'm listening to it right now just to see.
Okay, uh, we'll just go with it, um, let's try this out, I'm just listening to the sound, give me a moment. Testing, testing, testing into my voice. train 15 minutes to hit a schedule so far so good for my first day on the job oh I totally forgot my name tag isn't ready yet I should make one I'll just sign my name here oh my god this kind of handwriting I haven't seen since I was five <laughs> all right yeah, that looks like it. Gemini, did I spell it right? You spelled it wonderful. You you presented it five year old ish. Hope passengers can read my scribble. I hope they can too. I have my glasses on. Hope oh I'm sitting there like it threw me off. I wasn't expecting it to look like okay. I can see why the amount of gigabytes that it was. Uh, <laughs> Uh-oh, am I nervous? It's the first day of the job, Jitters. Working the train's dining car can't be so bad. Come on, Gemini, shake it off. All right, Taylor Swift. What the? F did he just slap himself? June, I did uh just see you hitting yourself, M Mr. Conductor, sir. How are you doing this morning? Confused because I see you slapping the crap out yourself. Ho ho ho! Quite all right myself, though feeling a little sweet, bittersweet. Yeah, I don't know why I can't read. Is that because you're a sweetie? Uh, we're not doing it. Is everything okay? We're, ju we're, ju I'm, we're just doing this. Well, truth be told, not really. Alas, today's my... Oh, yeah, today's my last day as conductor. I'm retiring after 32 wonderful years. Yeah, you deserve to retire. Time for me and the Mirage Express to say goodbye to one another. Why that sounds like... Oh, congratulations on retirement, sir. Thank you. My wife is very excited about it. She already got our plane tickets to Spagnolia Block. Why I felt like I seen this on Unleashed. Like that name. I feel like I did. 
Our shower's been on a frizz, so I'm excited to use the hotels. Oh my god, we're all gonna stink? Are you talking about your own place? I can see why his wife's excited. Enough of my quibbles. Today's your first day working the dino car. Here's the menu for today. Menu added to your... Okay. Inventory. I can open an inventory anytime to view items I've received. I should look around the menu carefully. The Mirage Express dining menu. It features chili doll, instant ramen, and chicken cardon blue. No fries? Pasta? A bowl of cereal? Okay. I'm sitting in the living room right now. I'm not even sitting in my room. Usually I would, but I just don't feel like it. I feel like just chilling right here. Why do you look so nervous? All we have on the train is a microwave. Yeah, ew, microwave. Okay. I am not a big fan of microwave food because it does not taste the same. Uh, I don't care what nobody says. It does not taste the same. It's not like it tastes like from the oven, came from your frying pan or what your our convection oven toaster oven it's a microwave and you can only heat it but so many times or at a certain amount of time for it like unless my food is like it's not as hot but it's still considered you know like a warm hot then fine for a short amount of period of time i am not i don't like microwave no i don't like microwave or anything unless it's popcorn i don't eat it Kid cuisine, squishy chicken nuggets, microwave. I'm not, no. Air fryer, something. It. Why do you look so nervous? Oh, we haven't changed. If you say so, I'm not eating that. Oh, he's a very jolly person. Though I'm sure a little quiz is in order. Oh, goodness. Which of these do we serve in the dining car? Crab ragu? Spicy grill picky? What is spicy grill picky? If you said like spicy grilled pork, man, ooh, what's that? I heard a crab ragu. Ding, ding, ding. Glad you can read the menu, okay? Oh, uh, yeah, I got it. Thanks, thanks, dude. A little about the vessel. This is a state of the art high speed smart train with all the latest gadgets. This train can really handle anything you throw at it. Oh, uh, murder? No, sorry. <laughs> Have we had a lot of ventures together? We've had a lot. Yo, I made that sound like a question. We had a lot of ventures together, me and this train. It's not easy to leave. After 32 years, I don't blame him for being wistful. The train is exclusively used for events. It's not a passenger train. I remember that from the interview. What's the event today? The tech event? Yep. We have something like that here in Texas. I, I'm not sure if it's in Austin. They, there's a murder mystery train. And after I seen like um the movie few years a couple of years back with uh detective conan i thought even though it was a real murder happened i thought it would have been really cool to do that and then i think halloween maybe a year later after i watched it they actually have that i'm like oh that's so cool i would totally do that nothing better than some thrills to end my tenure as conductor guests will be funneled here to the dining car as a home base to speak I'll be with you to gather tickets, but after that, you'll be on your own. Oh my god, we're gonna F up. So, I'll need you to do everything in your power to make sure our paying guests are, way, are well taken care of. Understood? Some customer service. I can't afford to lose this job. Yeah, I mean. Glad this old man can rest easy. Doors to Mirage Express are opening all aboard. Okay, let me get something to drink. I feel like we're going to be talking a whole lot. So.
Okay. I got tied up with the wires. I'm trying to. I will say the music is definitely on point. All right. What? Get it? Um. On a train. They just threw the beat in real quick, huh? I wouldn't. It's Sonic. That's my girl Amy. Gotta be a birthday. Hey, Amy. I was just looking at her headband. It's cute. Oh, it's my boy Tails. Wow, this train is incredible. What fascinating tech. Oh, yeah, he's all over. Vector. You're right, Tails. I can get used to staying on this on a train like this. What did you expect? You know I always go out for my birthday party. Okay, fashionista. Alright, Miss Moneybags. Oh, I love Rogue. This train is as elegant as you are, Amy. Can't promise I won't take anything, though. Oh, let's, let's uh, make sure her fingers are clipped. Oh, Knuckles. Calm down, Rogue. Did I not just catch you stealing from the train station gift shop? Yo, really? <laughs> Um, I had an occupation hazard for real. <laughs> it was a pen knucklehead. Who's gonna miss a tiny, teeny pen? A, a teeny, tiny pen. Yeah, don't steal regardless. Not that serious. You look like you can get a job just fine. What cast of characters am I stuck with? Well, Sega. <laughs> Get a, hold of your, get a hold of yourself, Gemini. You're sweating through your uniform. That's gross. Oh, look at Sonic. He's so cute. Hey, pal. Can I get one of those chili dogs? Oh, yeah. Chili dogs is his thing. Radio friend. Uh. Uh, are you a pirate? Oh, dang. Oh, no. I'm more nervous than thought. I was about to not click that. I was about to not click that. I wasn't going to click that because I was like, why? It makes me sound like I'm nervous. Sonic, wait until I announce everyone's rose to get food. <laughs> Sorry about that, birthday girl. I'll be coming around to collect everyone's ticket. Please have them out and ready. Will you join me, Gemini, won't you? Yo, what the? I'm telling you. You'll join me, Gemini, won't you? Just click on whoever you like to talk with and we'll collect their ticket. Uh, okay, got it. Ooh, I like her too. But why is Knuckles all the way in the back? Like, what's up with that? Where's the birthday girl? Could I please get the birthday girl's ticket? <laughs> why, certainly. Oh, gosh. Thank you, miss. And thank you for choosing our fine train for your birthday festivities. Well, the birthday discount certainly helped. Who doesn't love a good bargain? I do. This was a bargain. And a murder mystery chain just sounds so exciting. It's right up my alley. I'm sorry, I thought I just heard. It says, I can't see. Yeah, someone played a sound. Hi, he. I'm sorry. It's hard for me to look at um, chat because I, I, the way I have the screen set up. How are you? Who doesn't love a good thrill? You see, I'm a girl who loves a good true crime podcast. Oh, gosh. She's one of those. Um, I'm doing well. He, how are you? You're doing good? Play DVD? Dead by Daylight. Maybe we should leave her to her fun. Before we move along for you, miss, how was it? Oh, how fun, thank you. Where do I use this? That unlocks any door on the train. Happy birthday. Oh, she got the special key. Okay, we should play DVD. I'm good, I cannot play any type of horror games. I can't. 
I can't even watch it. I'm good. I've seen it on stream, and I've seen uh, part two. I'm good. I'm I'm well. I don't I don't want to play that. It's okay. I cannot. I get really horrible dreams with when it comes to horror stuff. So I. I uh, try to stay away from it. I can watch a little bit of it, but not too much. Yeah, it. I cannot. I cannot do horror whatsoever. Like I used to watch on um, The Walking Dead. I had to stop because my dreams were getting too vivid. And I was like, yeah, and, like it was really good to watch it. And after, I forgot what I got far too, and then I had to stop. I couldn't do it no more. Well, damn, yeah, I understand. I I don't know how people can do it. I cannot. Like, to me, Resident Evil 4 is not scary. It has moments where I jump when I watch streamers play it, but not like I'm terrified. I'm going to have dreams of it. Only for, for because I'm playing the PC game, so I stopped the sound alerts on this one. I didn't put it on this one. That's why. Because it's not a browser setting for this, that's why you don't hear it. Yes, yeah, stickers are on here, but the sound one is not. But only for when I play PC games, it's not. Very useful. We'll use this wisely. Thank you. Okay. I gotta click all of them. Um, since he's all the way in the back. All right, Knuckles. Howdy. Could I please get your ticket? What? I think that's a ticket. Oh, God, Knuckles. I couldn't do it when I saw it on stream, but then I tried it. It was unexpected, but once I played both perspective, it got predictable. Uh, what game did you play on stream? But I really don't want to argue with this guy. That his name is Knuckles. Everything looks good. Thank you. Seems the conductor doesn't want to argue either. Hmm. Oh, that was fast. I forgot his name. Could we please see your ticket? You don't stream? Uh... DVD, I mean, I don't. She okay. Can you please get your ticket. Of course. Oh, thank you. Excellent. Thank you, and I hope you enjoyed your stay with us. Absolutely, I appreciate it. Oh, he's one of those. There's a comment about him. Something about his presence pushed me at ease. All right. You kiss. Oh, that's his name. SP. I'm sitting here like I know him. I don't know his name. You consider me common? Oh, that's right. Don't he read moms? He's looking right at me. I study ninjutsu. I believe one can communicate through the subconsciousness. Goofball. What, ninjutsu? That sounds like a lot of difficult training. All right, Naruto. Can you cling on to walls? Wow. Cling on to walls. What kind of question is that? Most certainly I can. I mean, there is a game within Sonic where that is possible. I think there's a couple of them. The conductor looks a bit too smug at the answer. Okay. Okay, well. Why? Is, I don't even see Shadow. Why is Shadow in the, You know what? His name is Shadow. May I have your ticket? Thank you very much. On top of it, I see. Blaze. I love Blaze. A princess such as myself must always be punctual. All right, princess. P princess? Did she say princess? If you don't mind me asking, are you visiting from somewhere? A separate dimension, actually. <laughs> A separate what? Just here for Amy's birthday. Then I'll hop back to my own dimension. I quite prefer the birthday cake from this world more than my own, so I admit I'm a bit excited. Ho, ho, ho. Don't say that. Oh, you don't say. I'm telling you, I can't read. BRB? Well, I hope you enjoy your stay, princess. Sh should I bow? Do I bow before a princess? 
What are you doing? Please get up. Why can I not win with this group? You're doing absolute the most. Look, Look at this hair. Hi, Shadow. Thank you. Everything is in order. I totally get when somebody says Shadow looks like me at work. I had that face. Is anything we can help you with? I think I skipped by accident because I clicked my finger. He seems concerned about something. Yeah, okay. Do you sell gift bags here? Uh, uh oh. No, sadly, but I have a plastic grocery bag in, <laughs> in the back. I can get you what? That stare, it's cold, it is. As I'm looking at you like I asked for a gift bag, I'm gonna put somebody's gift in a grocery bag. Gemini, you're shivering. Do you need me to fetch your jacket? I need you to turn on the heat. Uh, no, no, I'm good. Hello, my friend, can I get your ticket? Uh, sure, of course. As a gentleman of upstanding morals, I'd love to show you my ticket. I already had a feeling about him. When he, do you got your tickets? He seems to be avoiding eye contact. Here he is. Is something amiss, sir? I seem to have uh, misplaced my ticket. Could you please speak up a bit? I couldn't quite hear you. Uh, speaking of my own words, I misplaced my ticket. I don't know where it is. He's not hiding his embarrassment very well. Don't worry, we'll take a look around for you and see if it turns up. I think. That would be amazing. Thanks a million. Wow, that's nice. Seems as though we should keep our eyes peeled for his ticket. Okay, I remember that. Can I get your tug? Your t what? Your tug? I saw a ticket in Youngin and put the words together. <laughs> Right here, sir. Thank you. May I offer you any of the snacks we have on board? You may offer nobody else. No, nope, thank you. When I travel, I always pack my own sparkle gelatin. It's a sparkly jelly that melt in any jaded heart to give it the shadow. No way, I brought my own sparkle gelatin with me too. It's my first day and I was a little nervous. Don't be nervous, you're doing great so far. We're sparkle gelatin buddies. <laughs> Absolutely, okay, sure. If you need anything, just let me know. Thank goodness someone on this train is normal. I mean, he's somewhat normal. My girl, Rose. Well, hello, you two. What can I do for you? Your ticket, did you steal it? Did you steal vectors? Good morning, ma'am. Can we get your ticket? My, my, how for it? Let me fetch it for you. Come back if you need anything else, you hear? Oh, are, are you, did you take my job? Wow, she's so polite. Very easy to talk to as well. Oh, yeah, of course, because she's a thief. Thieves are always polite. Well, in anime. <laughs> Ma'am, I saw you sneak that $20 bill out my pocket. See? I just said that. Gonna have to kindly ask for that back. Yeah, uh-huh. Yeah. Are we really gonna act stupid? Oh, this was yours? Must have slipped out. Here you go. I may not actually be best at judging character. Nah. You see what I said? <laughs> the man himself. I already hit y'all. Ticket, please. Thank you, Kali. Happy to have someone as renowned as yourself on board. You have no idea who this is? Don't worry about it. Technically, like, Sonic is around the same age as me. <laughs> if you think about it. Don't worry about it. I just like helping. And the chili dog. When Eggman took over, I truly feared the worst, but my kids swore you would swoop in eventually, and you did. I can't offer much other than my sincere gratitude. Don't sweat a thing. I'm glad you and your family are safe. Wait a second. Is he? Is he Sonic the Hedgehog? The one and only. I promise you an excellent stay on our train, Sonic. Have fun now. Yes, have fun now. We'll do things. That's everybody, right? I asked Blaze, I asked Rose, I, 
bros. Rogue, I asked Amy first. I asked Espia. I asked Vector, Shadow, Sonic, him. Yeah. Oh. Are, am I looking for a ticket? Do I click this arrow? Oh, look, the ticket. I, do I, I asked that. Do I look for a ticket? What's sticking out the napkin holder? Say, wasn't someone looking for the ticket earlier? Let's be sure to return th this to his rightful owner. And let's make sure no one uses their ticket as a napkin. Lost ticket is added to your inventory. All right. Find anything yet? Well, we might just... Well, we just might have what you need. Gemini, why don't you show your friend what we picked up? Ah, there it is. That's my ticket. Thanks so much, you both. Was really worried you kicked me out and I missed the murder mystery. If it was somewhere else, they would have. Oh, old Gemini here would have her, their hands full kicking you out. You, uh, sure. You're right, I wouldn't leave without a fight. Uh, that's great. That's great. They're okay. Wait, who made me both microwave expert and security guard? You're both all right, my book. Thanks again for the assist. Sure. Uh, of course, just let us know if you need anything else. Okay, everyone. It's time for me to read out everyone's roles for the murder mystery. And that's my cue to leave. I must prepare the driver's compartment for a departure. Ah, the conductor's car. You remember our promise, yeah? No. You'll do everything in your power to make sure our guests have a safe and enjoyable time with the Mirage Express. I sure forgot. Absolutely, you can count on me. I'm sitting here like, why? Because I went to go get something to drink. And I'm like, well, why can't you hear me? That's why. To be honest, this group seems plenty capable on their own. Okay, well, hot mess. And train? Oh, that's okay. Assist Gemini if they need any help, won't you? I thought that had something to do with Vector. R. That's all I need to hear. You have my trust. You heard something? Nothing more heartwarming than a conductor in his train. Excellent, I'll be off. I must take my leave, everyone, please. Have a phenomenal time. And don't worry about mucking up the place either. This train is a state of art and has systems for dealing with that. Oh, uh, well, all that, that's great. For everything else, please talk to Gemini here if you need anything. That's great, customer service. Sounds good. Absolutely. Will do. Uh, goodbye now. Oh gosh. I like that guy. Thank you all for following the outfit guide I sent you. You all look amazing. I trust you all read your lore cards as well. Okay. Lore cards. That must be the detail of their motivations. I suppose it makes sense lore cards aren't read out, uh, read out loud. Or otherwise people wouldn't know the murderer's intentions. Now on to the nitty gritty. For the murder mystery game, one of you will be murdered and the rest suspects. Everyone has assigned roles for characters they will be playing. Participation is required for It's My Birthday. All right, guys. So with me, I'm going to go get a pen. 
I got a notebook right here, but that was for me to get my password. But uh, something just tells me I need to, to remember stuff. I could just type it in my phone, but I'd rather just write it down because writing actually helps your memory. What in the? Okay, that was me. So give me one moment. I'll be right back. I'm gonna get a pen. And I'm back. So let me get a page open. Okay. Of course, birthday girl makes the rules. I just want to make sure I don't miss anything. And over see, this, you might overthink or you might not be sure. I know myself. So let me uh, make sure. I get everything. Sonic, you are a ship captain, and you'll be stationed in the conductor car. Naturally, that's where the captain would go. Tells, you are the detective. You'll be here in the dining car. Indubitably. Knuckles, you are the sheriff around these parts. We'll find you in the saloon. Got it. Rogue, you are a business tycoon, and Blaze, you are a titan of industry. Both are in the casino. What's the difference? There is none. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Hmm, sounds fun. Yeah, I bet it is because you're in a casino, thief. Vector, you are the butcher, and SPL, you're the poet. Both found in a library. What in the... I love Clue. Oh, you know what? Yeah, like I just got like a tinge of butterflies when I said when I thought of that when they said the library I was like wait clue played that so much as a kid. I think a couple years ago. I played it And do what read maybe we can make a tower of books or something Shadow is the locksmith hanging out in the lounge Hmm. All right And last but not least me the journalist reporter I'll be moseying around the, with everyone. Did you get all that? Oh, damn. No. <laughs> so, tells to the diner car. Doctor. 
Shadow of the Lounge. Blaze slash Rogue are in the casino. Vector and SPO are in the library. I thought it was eight, that's Amy. Amy is a reporter, so she's everywhere. Tells is a detective. Sonic's captain. Shadow is a lock. I'm putting in issues. Blaze is a tycoon. And then Rogue is industry, but it's basically the same thing. Vector is a butcher. SBO is the poet. Amy's the reporter. Got it. Yes, I did. I was listening. Hope that's okay. More than all right. You can help ensure everyone's following their roles. Oh, that reminds me. Oh, my Lord. That's the map. I have a map for each of you. Everyone's station is marked on a map as well. How convenient. Yeah. Map added to your inventory. Sonic's all at the top. So you. The rules of the game are as follows. There is a murder mystery. Of, uh, a murder amongst you all. The murder can kill a single participant however they choose. But you must physically be present with the victim for it to count. Okay. I'm sorry, I'm writing it down. All right. Everyone must collect evidence throughout the train and use it to interrogate fellow passengers to figure out who done it. The murder murderer will lie to get out being accused so inspect everyone you can clues and interrogate I'll set a timer for one hour so everyone can mingle and and the murderer can do their thing is everyone ready I got a feeling something else gonna happen on the train it's usually that way. Sounds like everyone's excited. Everyone to your stations. Like I'm, I'm glad I chose to sit in the living room for this because I'm just sitting on the couch. Ah, this is so exciting. I love the music. A mystery's unfolding right under our very noses. I know it's kind of scary. You see how she's excited? But I under. I understand her because I like stuff like this. I I buy I understand her thrill, so I'm not gonna be like, oh my god, Amy, something's wrong with you. No, I totally understand because to actually be a part of something like this is actually kind of same. Ah, isn't it awesome? It sure is. Shouldn't you two be out there mingling with everyone? Well, actually, the detective and the journalist can't be the murderer. Uh, well, why not? I put an asterisk. Technically. 
put Astro next to her. So we're stuck here for an hour before going out and scoping the place. This way, there's always a neutral party. So there's eight, so six people. Makes sense to me. Seems as though Amy's more excited about deciphering the mystery anyways. What do you think everyone's doing? Oh, probably expecting their stations and talking amongst one another. Everyone has roles to play, so they must be exploring their characters. Do you know what their characters' motivations are, Amy? No, the lore cards are confidential. No one knows but the person that received them. Okay. My backstory is that I was best friends with a fleeky that decided to join the du the du uh, wait I said the du so evil and doctor and put the words the evil doctor Eggman kickstart in my desire for justice in the world. So you was the you became a detective afterwards. You telling this? My lore is that I'm a nosy person turned journalist. Sounds like you. Not gonna lie, this kind of sounds fun. Wish I wasn't stuck on microwave duty. Oh, you're not gonna be for long. Uh oh. What the? F Yo, that actually startled me. The train started moving. Is it not supposed to? It's so fast. Grab onto something. What's going on? I'm slipping. Hold, hold on. I, I can't. Uh, ah! No. Hold. Okay. That's the conductor's area. Let me check sound. They're in the kitchen. I'm just checking sound on my phone, so I apologize. Because it might sound like it's okay for me and for y'all, but YouTube is, is different when you got to, I'm sorry, upload it. I'm testing sound. I'm gonna go back. And I'm gonna listen. My headphones is not on. I'm just talking to the mic, but I can hear music. I'm just waiting. This is like a five second delay. Testing, testing. Testing, testing. Okay, um... 
See, I knew something's gonna happen. If I could like flip my Alright, let's um let's go with it. You're both awake. Y yeah. It seems the train has slowed down considerably. But it crashed. Wow, how exhilarating, really? Is everyone okay? Yeah, my head's spinning a bit, but I'm okay. It seems we've been knocked into the dining car's closet. This train can reach such incredible speeds. Did it crash or did they crash in there? We're getting our money's worth for this experience. That's for sure. Is this actually intended? It's my first day, so I'm not really sure. Yeah, I don't think that's intended. I don't recall them warning me about this in an interview. No, something's going on. We should go check on the others. Gemini, could you get the door? Of course, you can't. Uh-oh. Hmm. It seems the door is blocked, and I don't think it's budging. Amy, give that fallen shelf a whack with your pico pico hammer. I'm about to say, does she got a hammer? Let's find another way out. I'll uh start looking for clues. Uh, Amy. Now, because she has simply forgot it, but she could have just said, I forgot it, or I didn't bring it because she didn't think she wouldn't have to use it. That could be it, but I still wrote that down. I'll search over here. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I know Amy. She's hiding something. Uh-huh. I suppose she did wake up before us. Something could have happened. Yeah. Listen, I know I'm the detective here, but all the best detectives have sidekicks. I ain't nobody sidekick. I'm gonna need your help. You're gonna need all my help because you're not gonna solve it yourself. Let's gather clues on why Amy's acting this way and interrogate her about it. I have no problem doing that. Check out ev everything you can around this closet. Then we'll show it to Amy to uncover the full situation, okay? Gather evidence and interrogate. Got it. <laughs> I'll need you to do everything in your power to make sure our paying guests are well taken care of. Understood? Yeah. Understood. You can count on me, Tails. I won't turn evil like your ex flicky companion did. Happy to hear it. Now let's get, the, get searching. Okay, so it wasn't Tails. It was Flicky. I'm looking to see what all I can Something's always hitting the trash. Let's check here. Sadly, it's empty. But on the bright side, this is a very clean crash trash bin. How do I become as optimistic as this kid? What do you think, Tails? Want me to cook any of this for you? When we get out of here, sure. I normally never make microwave meals. I prefer to cook. My cast iron skills has gotten a lot used. Yeah, thank you. I can cook a mean cast iron pizza. Oh, that sounds so good. I only had microwave lunch <laughs> last this week. Now, talking about that. What's this? A rod? It's broke. The tip is broken. It looks to have originally been attached to something. I'm not sure if it led to our mystery, but I like spinning it around. Well, so we'll keep it. Stick is added to your inventory. Make sure it's nothing else. 
what? I have a wet floor sign. Keep people alert and safe. Once I slipped on some spilled juice at the grocery store, no wet floor sign at all. Luckily, Sonic was there to catch me. Wow, Sonic really is fast, as they say. But he was going so fast, he slipped on the juice. We slid to an older gentleman's shopping cart. Well, it's the thought that counts, I suppose. The shelf block at our exit is currently not budging. Hey, Gemini, look closely at this. Something, something looks off about that. Yeah. I wonder how this side of the shelf got smashed. Like someone hit it. There's nothing the shelf could have fallen into, and I'm sure this damage wasn't here before. The train has, has too much upkeep. I feel like this is important. We should log it. Crack on the shelf is added to your inventory. I think we found enough clues. Let's go interrogate Amy and find out what really happened. What's the latest? Find any clues yet? I found the spoon. If we find two more, we can dig ourselves out. Dig ourselves out on a train. I'll keep looking. Oh, that is talk. I thought she was gonna say something different, okay. Whoa. All right, music change. Amy, we believe you're hiding something from us. What? You accused me on my birthday? It don't matter, it's your special day. How dare you? How dare I not? This isn't going to be easy, is it? I've been stuck here just like the two of you. What in the world do you think I'm hiding? It's on like a, a sonic level. Amy was awake before Tails and I were. What could she have done in that time? Something to that show. Took to escape. Murder suspect. I don't think you were sitting in alley while Jim and I, and I were knocked out. You attempted to escape the closet. Prove it. Show me evidence I attempted to escape or help me search for a way out. Do you have evidence to prove that? Jemai, let me, let me step you through this. First, find the correct piece of evidence from your inventory. Once that has been deduced, we might we must form our argument to fight back. Okay. All right, let's do it. What proves Amy attempted to escape the dining car closet? What, some damage on itself supposed to prove something? It fell over. Damage makes sense. You have no argument here. You're grasping. Oof, okay, Tails, what now? Well, now we follow the train of thought. What does the crack on the shelf relate to Amy? So now I have to explain myself. Well, you see, uh, well, um, when I get stumped. <laughs> what would Sonic do? What would Sonic do? Sonic's a force to be reckoned with. He's always running for it. Collecting rings, crashing, vent. he never loses. Like, I can endless runner game. I play a lot of those on my phone. Oh, crap. They're going to make us play a game? Oh, sure. Whatever works. Just close your eyes and think. What was Sonic doing? Find your argument. All right. Let's prove we're not grasping. Let's follow the train of thought and fire a comeback. Like Sonic would do. What? What the? Oh, we're losing. I don't... Um, can somebody teach me how to start the game? So I'm clicking, right, guys? Oh. No, I'm clicking. What button do I click? It didn't tell me that. Get every button and the beef is awesome, but can I at least explain?
Yo, I barely made it. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Sure the shelf fell, but there's nothing around for the shelf to fall into. You're telling me on a train this well kept that the damage was here before we arrived? Mm. What, what I I believe someone is responsible for hitting the shelf. You just said nothing was around for the shelf to fall into. What was the shelf hit with then? What is that, a stick? You truly believe a stick could do this kind of damage? Amy, we all know what you can do. Again. Yo, I gotta be on my P's and Q's with this. Yo, my foot was in here. My foot, my finger. Oh my God, we're about to die. Let's see. I think you're throwing around a stick a bit too much. Jim, let's try to try and throw it again, shall we? Oh, I'm glad I got another chance because Yeah, this is actually tricky. <laughs> You're right, a stick can't do this kind of damage to the shelf on its own. But if it's attached to something it could, let's say a hammer. Mm-hmm. This isn't a stick at all, is it? This is actually the handle to your Pico Pico hammer. The stick, my bad. You attempted to hit the shelf out of the way, but you failed. The handle to your hammer snapped right off. Why you feel like you gotta hide that? Uh, why you trying to get out? Ah! Realization. It's as both you said, I tried to get us out with my hammer, but I fell. I gave the shelf one big whack and the handle ripped right off. I figured it was no big deal and tried to hide it, but I suppose my embarrassment got the better. Like, really? She does genuinely look sorry about the situation. I never expected your hammer to snap like that, hey, Amy? It was one of my backups. It's a little lighter to carry around. I didn't think I needed it. Well, lucky for you, I'm a detective and I dab as a mechanic. You sure do. Let me see both pieces of your hammer. Just tighten things here, a little elbow grease there, and fix. Tails, thank you. According to my calculation, if you hit the shelf right here, it should do the trick. All right, stand back. My voice cracked. The shelf completely shattered. Incredible. Yo, Gemini, it's 2 a.m. here, so got a dip, girl. See you later. Have my classes tomorrow. All right, you have a good night, and good luck with your classes. Thank you for showing up. We did it. We're free. You sure are. Great job, Amy. Let's get out of here. Oh, no. Yeah, it's the whole train, like I thought. All right. Might seem. Yes. In 15 minutes, I'm gonna take like a little break and I might order me some pizza. I'm really hungry. What is that? It can't be. Sonic? Someone murdered my darling Sonic. Oh, let me say this in a happy time. Someone murdered my darling Sonic. Looks like the game's begun. But he's in the wrong area, right? I'm finding out who did this at once. Amy, wait. I'm a, I want to figure out who did this too. Wait for me. What a whirlwind. I'm exhausted already. That was really convincing, Sonic. Sonic? Maybe he's just knocked out. Uh, did he choke off a corn dog? I don't like some juice spill. He's positioned. His body is turned like that. It's just okay. Body numb. Can't 
move. Sonic saying it? Body, somebody poisoned you? Did you hit something hard? What are you saying? I don't understand. I just need to rest. Sonic? Sonic? He's actually hurt. He's not moving. Are these wounds on him genuine? My hand's on his wrist, but I don't sense the pulse. Am I doing this right? What in the world's going on? Is this the point of the murder mystery, or is this serious? Nah. Sonic! Sonic! Oh, no. Oh, no. I feel myself panicking. Calm down, Gemini. What do I do? Go back. I need you to... Oh, yeah. Okay. These guests are incredibly... Renowned, which means they must be remarkably rich. Why would that matter to you? What? So I leave their care to you, Gemini. My favorite employee, surely you won't let me down. Remarkably. Okay, we'll just keep some things. I don't want to be overthinking, but I'm just, I'm going to keep some things to myself. I need to catch up to Amy and Tells and get to the bottom of this. Even this part is, even this, if this is the part of the game, I can't risk it. Just can't risk it. I'll keep everyone self conductor. Everyone's safe. God damn. You'll see. Oh, wow. The murder of Sonic the Hitchhiker. That's how it started off? Oh my gosh. How did they move that fast that it did that? Like something seemed like it asked, like that's just weird. It's not the first time it took off before. So why did it move to the point that everything started to crash? There anyway. And who did Knuckles break there? Did he lose? Whoa, look at this place. I'm over here. I think Amy's already gone ahead. It seems she's really excited. Did you need something from me? Yeah, can you take a good look at Sonic? Uh, yeah. Just a question, really. How do I put this? What if Sonic is actually hurt? Ha! Yeah, he ain't listening to that. He's laughing. Sonic doesn't go down so easily. He's on a train full of friends. Nothing would actually happen to him. We're just all really committed to the mystery for Amy. You have nothing to worry about, promise. So, yeah, let's, let's throw all that out the window. We're, let's worry. Plus, Sonic likes to nap a lot of strange spots. He's fine. Wish that is true, but still. But I can't shake what Sonic said to me. He's numb. And he just needs to rest. Is this really part of the murder mystery game, or is there something deeper happening? I need more evidence to figure out what's going on. All right. What in the way? Everyone, I'm good. Hope your day's going good. I'm good. I'm fine. I was about to order some pizza because I don't feel like cooking. 
I decided to play a new game. It's called The Murder of Sonic the Hedgehog. So far, I'm not sure if something really happened to him. How is everyone? I, oh my goodness. Good. Phoenix, how are you? Hi, Lena. How are you? Oh, goodness. I was not, I was so confused. Like, what, why is, why is Sonic dropping beats in the back? <laughs> oh my goodness. I apologize. How is everyone? How was your stream, Brandon? How did it go? Did you get far? I saw that she was at the part with that alien looking creature that you have to freeze. It's okay. I hope you froze him and didn't waste your ammo. It went good. It was fun. Okay. I'm good. How are you? I'm doing well. I'm starving. I'm not going to lie. Oh, yeah. Okay, <laughs> guy. <laughs> oh, goodness. I'm doing well. I'm hungry. It's out. No, what? Yeah, that, that dude that you. Yeah, he, he was a waste of swear jar. <laughs> he, he, uh, I was like. Should I tell Brandon he has to freeze up or should he just find out for himself? I have to get ready for work. Unfortunately, no, you are fine. Oh, um, Brandon, I had to do a video interview yesterday. So we'll see how that went. I'll let, let you guys know. That was my first time doing anything like that. So we'll see how it goes. It, I had to sit there and answer questions, do multiple choice. It felt like I was streaming. It didn't feel like it was something um, I had to worry about. Really? It wasn't hard. I just had to answer some questions. So we'll see how it goes. I, I wasn't expecting them to reply with the video interview because they said it could take a couple of days, but they replied back fast the same day, but the same hour. So I was like, okay. So I will let you know how it goes. It's part times and it's remote. So we'll see. But thank you for stopping by, Brandon. I hope you have a wonderful day at work. Thank you, Lena, and everyone else. <laughs> thank you so much. I was so confused. Like, why is there a hip hop beat in the background of Sonic? Now I understand. Hopefully it goes well. I really do hope so. So I, right now I'm just relaxing. I'm in the living room. <laughs> I didn't feel like being in my room. So I'm in the living room, just sitting here streaming. So I was like, you know what? I'm gonna try out something different. I'm gonna stream from my living room on the couch. That's awesome. Thank you. No problem. I hope everything you'll be lurking. No, thank you. Love you too as well. Enjoy the rest of your day. Have a good day at work. Let me know how it goes. Back onto who murdered us, Sonic, because I really think something happened to him. So for those that are joining in, this is a new game that came out not too long ago called The Murder of Sonic the Hedgehog. I'm a huge Sonic the Hedgehog fan. Um, it's one of the first games that I played with the Green Hill, uh, Green Zone. I think that and the one with Tails, I can't remember. I just know he's one of the first games I played on Sega. Um, they decided, I guess, after years of this, of the making to make a detective story, I guess fans wanted this. I just happened to be on YouTube April 1st and I was scrolling down and I seen this and I was like, what's, what's going on? Is this real? And it's a game and it is free to play. And it has overwhelmingly positive reviews. The first day it came out, it came out March 31st. Um, but I didn't see until April 1st and I'm playing it now. So I said, you know what? I'll try it out. I just started playing. So, so far, um, it's the train of mystery. Basically it's a real thing they have. I know here in Texas, we have one. Um, it's a train that you can do murder mystery and you dress up and you play the parts of whatever they give you on your cue cards. So someone is murdered. Someone's the detective. Someone is rich. Someone is the butler, stuff like that. So it's Amy's birthday and she decided she wanted to do a murder mystery on a train. 
Um, she's the reporter. I wrote down stuff just in case. Tails is the detective. Sonic is the captain, but he's also murdered. Um, Shadow is the locksmith. He's in the lounge. Blaze and Rogue are the basically tycoons, industry tycoons. They're in the casino. Vic Vector the alligator, he is a butcher with Espio. He is the poet there in the library. And Amy is the reporter. She's everywhere. So, so far, the only two people that is not allowed to commit the murders is the reporter, which is Amy, and Tails, which is the detective. They were both with me inside of the kitchen closet of the dining area. Suddenly, the train was going too fast that we crashed into it. We don't know what's going on. Uh, we woke up and now we're trying to figure out what happened as we arrived in the area that Sonic was in. He was supposed to be in the conductor area. He was not. He was in the dining area. And it don't seem like to me that he's actually playing. I believe something really did happen. And he's unconscious at the moment. I don't think he's dead, but something did happen. So right now we're in the saloon. Knuckles is supposed to be here in the saloon. Did I put? Oh, I didn't put Knuckles. Look, I think I'm playing. I'm sitting here writing stuff down. Knuckles is the sheriff. And he's supposed to be in the saloon. All right, there you go. Let's let's get back to it. I don't know why that arcade machine is cracked. We just got here. Can I tag along with you? If you don't mind, is it cool if I tag along with you? Oh, of course, sure. Now, if I ever need a snack, <laughs> you got me. <laughs> you got God gave you hands. Use them. Ah, fair. As I said, the best detective has sidekicks, so I'm happy to have you. If you ever catch me looking glum, though, just know it's because, uh, where's my lore card? Okay. So, another thing. Everyone has their own cards. They're not allowed to know what's in their cards. That's their character cards. They are not allowed to know. Amy don't even know. She just gave out the cards, but they're not allowed to know themselves what their characters are supposed to do and um, what's inside their cards whatsoever. So this is our first time looking at the lore cards. So we're right now, Tells is telling us what's going on. The last guy to work a case with me ditched our practice to join. Okay, so this must be true. I thought that was part, I thought he was playing. So it's this little bird chick thing named Flicky. Think he actually was supposed to be with Tails to practice, but he joined Dr. Eggman. That part is real. Okay. Yeah, that's actually a problem. Now that I think about it. And I'm not sure how far he practiced with this little bird, but if he practiced enough to tell Dr. Eggman what was going on within his entails lore card, he can lore card, he can give some hints to what's going on in the train. That is actually a problem. We're gonna keep that in the back of our minds. All right. Not a proper detective without baggage. This is true. Your vermits. <laughs> wow. Yo, send me Sam. What you doing on my saloon? He's trying so hard to stay in character. <laughs> Knuckles, we're trying to figure out who murdered Sonic. I can see that. Amy mosey through and told me all about it. <laughs> Enough of that. Wonder how long he kept that voice for Amy. We were wondering if you could tell us what you were up to before the murder. Anything to help us establish your alibi and... Nope. I have nothing to tell either of you. Leave me alone. Wow. He's obviously agitated about something, but why take it out on us? Because he broke the arcade machine. 
I don't see nothing else broken here but that RK machine. There's red lipstick on that cup. I'm, okay, I'm sorry. I watch a lot of Detective Conan. I read a lot of detective books. I love a lot of detective shows. It was a show called Monk when I was younger, maybe middle school, high school. I used, oh my God, I love watching the crap out of that just to see if I could figure out the crime before anyone else. Like I grew up watching like 90s, like, and I was a kid. Shows on Detective, like even older ones like Murder, She Wrote. Yeah, it's put me in my feels. I'm sorry guys, I start to like geek out a little bit by watching it. I know better than to argue with Knuckles, it, so it seems we're on our own. Gemini, we need to figure out what Knuckles was up to while we were apart. He broke the damn arcade machine. Let's investigate for clues and interrogate. Right, let's do it. So, those cups, I'm gonna get them out the way. Oh, we can move around? That one ain't broke. That's the hand that helps with the train. But it makes me wonder. I'm suspicious about two things, maybe three, but I'm trying to keep it wanted. Why do I look like the Green Hill Zone with the palm trees? All right, okay, I look, okay guys, I'm all over the place, this is a lot. It's really not a lot, I'm just, I'm just doing the most. All right, let's check this out. Clearly you won't be able to give the game Super Monkey Ball. Oh, I'm about to actually get that game. Oh, I, I played that when it came out on the ten, no, on, yeah, the Nintendo game. On GameCube? When Super Smash Brothers was first a thing, yo. I, I'm, I, I'm trying to get the games that I used to play as like a kid and a teenager. Like I'm, so far I got a couple of them so I can play on stream, yo. Clearly, yeah, so we don't think it broke when the train sped up. The damages look more to be caused from punches. <laughs> Who could have done that? We all know. What are you two looking at me for? Smashed arcade is added to your inventory. You know why we looking at it. Something's always hitting a trash can. Last time it wasn't. But you gonna say that? I'm starting to think your theory of something always being hitting a trash can is flawed. No. It's better time tells have faith. As they say, one man's treasure is another man's treasure. I think tells is ignoring me. He sure is. It's okay. We won't pull him in the trash. Did Rogue or I don't remember at Blaze having lipstick on. I don't know if Rogue had. I don't think that color. Gemini, this is interesting. What is it? It's just a few cups. Sure, but why are there three? Uh, Knuckles was really thirsty. Yeah, Knuckles and two females. One? Gemini, this one has lipstick on the rim. That's not Knuckles' color at all. Someone else must have been here. We should log this. All right, y'all. Three cups and saloon red lipstick on one. Yo. It look, almost looked like the doctor handwriting. I can't read that. All right. I think we found enough clues. Huh? Let's interrogate Knuckles and find out what really happened. What? No, we ain't done. Decent cash reward for finding this robot. Maybe I'll keep an eye out. Poor Omocho. Hate to see them like this what they do. Medical malpractice. Oh my god. Interesting. Fine mini robot. Got it. Breathtaking views. This train passes by some incredible sights. I'm just happy to be traveling at a normal speed. I get nauseous pretty easy. I have to avoid things like roller coasters. But you be on your airplane like it's no joke. 
I don't mind roller coasters, though I find myself running on the tracks more than I do. Oh, yeah. I'll never understand this friend group. Play the game, you understand. The robotic arms here. Oh, there's multiple of them. Okay. What's the arm doing to my hair? He fixed it up a bit. That's incredible. What interesting tech. Uh-oh. Should I fear my job a little bit? Well, how well can... Look. How well can it microwave? Gotcha. Oh, the bowl of assortment, assorted nuts. The classic saloon set. I promise you I can read. I got my glasses on. I'm sitting close and I still can't. I did this when I was playing Doki Doki, which now that I got Doki Doki Plus, we'll be going back to that. Because I thought it was the second season. No, it was just more stuff to do. I feel stupid. Crunch Crunch. Kind of bland. Some bland peanuts? Hmm. Seems like someone licked all the salt. It's gross. I'm going to punch you in your tongue for doing that. That's just so nasty. And then Tails just ate that. I'm writing this down. One licked. That's something a child would do when they don't like something and they just lick all the, all the seasoning off. Licked. Someone licked all the salt. The. What the hell wrong with you? That's gross. What? What? <laughs> or maybe they're just unsalted. All right, we'll put an astro mark just in case. Oh, are you sitting there doing that? You gross. Huh? That's funny. The door is locked tight. We can't go any further? I wonder how Amy was able to leave. You can go under it. I'm just saying. The locksmith? Shadow is the locksmith, right? Good point. When were these doors locked and how long were they locked for? Yeah, so we don't know if they were locked prior to the... Amy being there or after Amy? We'll have to keep this in mind. Alright. Let's go talk to Knuckles. I thought I told you leave me alone. Ha, I thought I like your hat. Please don't beat me up. Oh, he blushing. Knuckles, are you blushing? Such a soon today. I said leave me alone. It doesn't look like he used to being complimented. Did you just adjust your head a bit so we could see you better? I said leave. I'm not hungry. Well, if you ever are, let me know, won't you? Sure, like a butler source, right? Come on, Gemini, you're not a butler. Tell him that. I'm not a butler. Uh, yeah, like a, uh... Excellent. Thank you, butler. Wow. Some backbone you got, dude. Alright, I gotta put stuff down, because here comes the BS. The music is just... Don't this sound like a boss battle for Sonic? Like, or getting up to one? Knuckles, Gemini and I need to determine what you're doing. The hour the murder took place, what you were doing. I already told you, buzz off. You're not getting anything out of me. Thankfully, we don't need to say much. What happened here is pretty obvious. It, it is? We have evidence too. We we do? I almost said that, then I stopped. Gemini, just take a good look at our inventory. What was distracting Knuckles during the time Sonic was murdered? The arcade machine, huh? What makes you think I touched it? Oh, here we go. Here comes the BS. Oh, my God. What the fuck? What the fuck? What the? Yo, we're losing. We're... Oh, my mother. Yo. 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 I'm used to having a controller. You have no argument here. You are weak. <laughs> okay. Give me a moment, guys. I am so not to play, not used to playing Sonic. To be honest, why would I? Yo. I, I'm not talking.
I skipped all of that. Why? Alright, that's better. Yeah. And this was a controller? I have no problem. This isn't a tough one, Knuckles. Knuckles, you clearly touched the arcade machine because... What happens if you have the damages or punches? What are you staring at my hands for? Knuckles, you clearly destroyed the arcade machine, but why? I need a punching bag. None were available to me? Just a certain urge to punch, huh? I believe repairing the arcade machine will give us the answer. How will you? I'm on it. Gemini, distract Knuckles while I fix the Brunky Ball. Bring it on. What, huh? What the fuck? I could at the... F you! F you! F this game! Oh my god! Oh no, 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 no. Did you try again? I suck at this! I am a, I could play Sonic all day. But you want me to sit here on the key, on the keyboard. Yo. Oh, I give up. Oh, I give, I give, I, no, we ain't make it. I, this is, this is enough. All right, all right, all right, here we go. I'm so not used to it. Like, Melatonin, okay, which is another game I, I'm, I will be playing again. Bread, apple toast. It's like a bunch of hungry. I'm putting Vector on here because why was he here? Vector should have been here. Vector should have been in the library. Nothing, obviously. It tells us something massive. Look at the name on the top of the. It's Vector. He's yeah. He's supposed to be a library car. The picture's beginning to be painted here. You competed with Vector to see who could get the highest score, and Vector beat you. And in frustration, you destroyed the arcade cabinet. Yo, he sure did. He fixed the crap out of that. Go ahead. You need to come here and fix some stuff here. He's punching an air in frustration. You're guessing. Where's your proof? Where's your evidence? Vector's a common name. Prove me re <laughs> he was here down. Okay. What? Knuckles, if you don't stop being stubborn. I pushed the button. You have nothing, Zilch. Nada. You got me too deep. Okay, I gotta take a break soon so I can order some pizza. And Tells is being a grumpy umpy pants. I made that just in time. I made that just in time. Now, Gemini, what proves Vector was here with Knuckles? Because technically, he could have had the high score, right? Before he played with Knuckles. And Knuckles could have saw that score and was like he lost to Vector. That could be it, even though we know that's not true. He was here playing the game with him. No? 
I thought it was strange there was more than one cup sitting next to you. While you were supposed to be participating in the murder mystery game for Amy's birthday, you and Vector enjoyed some drinks playing arcade. It's um, it's not like you, Vector, or who else? Between Rogue and Blaze, which one of y'all? It's not, I wasn't, uh, don't tell Amy. I think we're on the right track here. It's as you say. Vector popped in at the top of the hour wanting to play the arcade machine with me. We spent, we went back and forth trying to figure the game out, but when we did, we competed for the highest score. When he bested me, I destroyed the machine. No proof of his win. I was trying to fix the arcade cat before you two came in, honest. I didn't want to be caught. And that's my story, an alibi. I already told you a bridged version of this to Amy. Boy, this friend group has a lot of pride issues. They sure Amy didn't want nobody to know she broke her own hammer. Knuckles broke the arcade machine because he lost to Victor. Vector. Well, that explains one of the used cups. But what are the cup with the lipstick mark? Oh, you ain't gotta tell me. Rogue was here too. All right. All right, lipstick look more pink than red, but it's inconsequential. Not worth mentioning. No, it's not. It's worth mentioning. She searched around for something but fell. Made fun of our game and left. She's a thief anyway. Like, I already told you she was going to steal. She sure did. As soon as she came in, she was stealing. Before she got on the train, she was stealing. Obnoxious is that one. But you offer... Okay. Rogue was looking for something in the saloon. But you offer her a drink, apparently. Listen, I don't know why she showed up. I already, I've told you everything I have. Look, I've been making up my own stories and lines. Are you not satisfied? Will you two relent? Hmm, I'm understanding the scenario. Vector visit to play games. Rogue couldn't find something and left, and Knuckles destroyed the machine. That all makes sense to me. Thank you for answering so many of our questions. Actually, that's not everything, is it, Knuckles? I want to step back to something I noticed. One more name on that high score list. Does it make sense? Gemini, can you take a look at, take a look one more time? An odd name on the high, what is Tails talking about? All right, so if you look at Vector Knuckles, makes sense. Toast, apple, bread, bagel, candy. That's all food, who's this? And if you look at his score, his sco their score is almost the same as Knuckles and Vector. Vic yeah, Vector, yeah. Ultimate. All the other names have food things, but this one? Who goes by the name Alt? You may not know Gemini, but there is someone here that goes by that title. The ultimate life form. Shadow? Shadow! Shadow. He was in the saloon. Nothing sneaks you, does it? But Vector and I were struggling so much with the game, but then Shadow dropped by. So Shadow was here too. He taught us the game and was the first to get his name on the scoreboard. Vector and I fought to beat Shadow's score. They're both very annoying. You all immediately had to compete, huh? He gave me this before he left. He gave me this key? Knuckles told me to lock the door and to not open it for anyone. Then he left. Then Vector was leaving. I locked the door behind him. Saw no one else after locking the door. So you locked the door after Shadow and you locked the door after Vector? That's the honest truth. So when Amy came through here not too long ago, did you open the door for her? No. I think she has some sort of key too. She's allowed to go everywhere. That's right, the conductor gave her the special birthday key. Well, I have a lot of questions. What happened in the library to cause Vector to come here? Why is Shadow locking doors and what was Rogue searching for? I don't know, they didn't tell me. Even though I asked with that cowboy accent, you're gonna have to, let, have to find them and ask them yourselves.
Thank you. More information than I expected to get there, but it seems we can move on. As of right now, I believe your story, Knuckles. We only know for sure when we confirm things with Vector. Fair enough. The library is the next car. I'll open the lock for you. Give whoever Kato Sonic an ear for me, Detective Tails and Butler. I like it better when he wasn't talking to us. <laughs> Will do, Sheriff. Come on, Gemini. Let's head to the library. On it. This is way more exciting than microwave and chili dogs. That's gross. Gemini. Coming. 